Howdy folks, TJ here. Found a fun little puzzle game. I love puzzle games because you can tend not to have to rush through said game. You can think, you can uh, sit there, ponder, unless there's a timer on it, uh, which some, some cruel specky programmers do. They'll add a timer to it too. But if it's a peaceful, uh, graphic, uh, arcadey puzzle game, I love those because it makes you think, and I love using my limited brain power for some of these kind of things. It's like, if you ever go to a store and they have one of those bottles that has like a hamburger inside the bottle, and they say, how did I get the hamburger in the bottle? I don't know why I said hamburger, but maybe I'm hungry already. But they put big things in the bottle, and there's no way you could put them in there, but yet they're in there. So how did it get in there? Those things stupefy the hell out of me, just like 3D printing. I do not understand how you can get a 3D printer to print shit. That doesn't make sense to me. My brain does not compute. But this game, from what I understand, has no sound, very limited graphics, yet needs to be a Specky 128 game. Very strange. Uh, it's called, what the hell was it called? Mr. Mushroom, Mushroom, uh, Mushroom something. <laughs> Let's read up the destructions. And then we'll, we'll turn off the lighting and focus in on shit. Uh, it says... Uh, this, uh, so it's Mushroom Man. Mushroom Man. Uh, not the Magic Mushroom Man. Although Magic Mushrooms... I, I don't take drugs, but from what I understand, <laughs> mushrooms can be fun. I mean, you go back to the 60s, Magic Mushrooms. This is the 48 version of the game Mushroom Man from Paul Equinox Collins. Uh, that's a mushroomy name. Uh, I, I, my name is Equinox Man. That's my name. <laughs> Uh, I should bring back... What the hell was that? I used to do a character. Uh, it's been so long, I forgot... Uh, oh, Rainbow. Uh, yeah, I don't have it in... <laughs> I, I've done some weird shit. <laughs> Haven't we all? We just... I don't keep it in the closet. I just do it. Okay, this version from Hacho Spoonyuap has some bugs, and these are resolved, and other graphics are used. Also, 13 extra levels have been added. After loading, press any key, and a level code, a false level code, will start level one. Hopefully it has a code here. If not, I guess you just start at level one by entering in just some random shit. Uh, you are the Black Mushroom Man. Your goal is to get to the exit of each level suitable marked with a bright E. This is a very, it sounds like this type of game could have very well been done on a ZX80, ZX81 Timex Sinclair 1000 or 1500, uh, if you got a letter E. And <laughs> when they start going to asterisks as a uh, thing, you know you're, you're touching those old bounds of very basic games. Uh, on your way towards the exit, you will find all kinds of obstacles. i got something in my eye. Uh, probably the letter E. <laughs> ooh. E stands for ooh. <laughs> What's in his eye? Okay, on your way towards the exit, you will find all kinds of obstacles which must be concurred. That's a weird word for this. Concurred. Okay. Uh, you can... Uh, that's proper English, probably. That's why it doesn't make sense to me. You can open a lock with a key. You can bribe magenta mushrooms with cash. Uh, it has to be magenta mushroom. So uh, apparently there's color in this. You can fill a hole with cement. You can go through water with oxygen. Each obstacle will cost you a solution. Water will remain on the screen. Other obstacles will disappear. An oxygen tank contains three units of air. Wow, I've got to remember this stuff. Okay. Uh, with a gun, you can blow up items in the direction you go. With a bomb, you blow up the nine fields around the bomb. Dynamite must be not blown. So apparently there's dynamite. I don't want to blow up that. Some fixed op... Do I collect the dynamite, though? I don't know. Some fixed obstacles besides dynamite are red brick and red concrete walls. The red brick walls can be destroyed by a bomb or a gun. You can push beans... <laughs> this quacky-ass game. You can push beans, but only if the field behind the bean is free. Transporter rooms will bring you the other transporter uh, bring you to the other transporter and move you out in the direction the arrow points transporters uh, rooms are usable in both directions 
When you blow up one transporter, either with a gun or bomb, the other will disappear too. Okay, you don't want to do that. Uh, when you solve a level, you will go to the next. If you want to quit and continue the next day, you must use a save option from the emulator you use. I don't use that. So apparently, um, I wonder if the save, I could use the save state on the next, I guess. I guess. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I think you could do that. Uh, there, I, I don't think I've ever done that yet. I'm not a cheater. I don't cheat. <laughs> there is no direct access to levels you have reached in the 4K version. Well, it's a 4K version. Controls are Q, up, A, down, O, left, P, right, which is, I like. R to restart level, press twice. R, uh, start other level, press once, then any key to level code. R, <laughs> so if I just press it once, and then any key, it's going to then level code me, and I type in that code. Okay, after level 188, wow, uh, you will go back to level 1. Have fun, Dr. Beep. So that's interesting. A lot of text there. Let's launch the game, and then we'll turn off the lighting and see what the hell this looks like. Mushroom, what the hell was it called? Mushroom Man? Uh, mushroom, uh, mushroom Man 2011. So this is not a 1980s game. Uh, it's 2011, but it's, it appears to be a game made after somebody else that made it before then. Who knows when that was made? So let's launch it. Mushroom Man. Let me focus in on the screen. Turn off the light. I gotta go pee. <laughs> uh, I didn't bring a bottle today, so, uh, uh, let's focus in on the screen. Okay. Mushroom Man by Paul Equinox. Hey, Equinox, how you doing, man? I'm gonna become rainbow anytime I can feel it. Ported to the Sinclair ZX Spectrum by Hajo Spunup. Uh, Spunup? Uh, am I recording this thing? Uh, yeah, I'm seven minutes in. Some people will probably go, just play the game. <laughs> I don't want to play it yet. You've got to take your sweet time. 2011 edited version by Dr. Beep. Okay, look at these. The, the graphics look like something I could do, <laughs> which is cool. I just love the old feel like making a, a love cassette romance from the 1970s. You made a cassette for your girl, or 1980s, uh, and you drew on it, and you made a little drawing. You made your own cassette. And that's what this reminds me of. Any key, I'm going to press return, and there's an asterisk. <laughs> and if I remember right, you just start typing, because I don't have it. It didn't give me a code, so let's just hit return, a line, return, line, return, return, return. Okay. Apparently, I'm there. Keys open locks. So I've got zero dollars, zero keys, uh, zero whatever the hell that is, <laughs> and zero that. Okay, um, what were the things that you collect? Uh, I forget already. Uh, but look, there's the little dude. Uh, am I uh, focused in on this screen enough? Um, yeah, I think so. Uh, uh, let me do, uh, will this make it any bigger? Or am I already on 50? Oh, no, that's bigger. Let me, let me focus. So that's good. You'll see things a little better. Uh Shimmy the Schuster's over here and focus in. Okay. Uh, so there's a. I need to write down that code. <laughs> uh, let me get a piece of paper. Uh, code zero 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 one forty one. Okay, I wrote that down. So here's the little dude. There's keys uh, and there's locks. So apparently I've got three keys. I gotta get to this exit. And not waste my precious time because when you touch things, uh, I need to lean off camera and pick my nose. <laughs> my nose is running. Oh, 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 God. Okay, so uh, let's just move a little bit and see what happens. Okay, so move to the right. Oh, see, he shimmies. Uh, he shimmies and he walks. Okay, I'm on level one apparently. So now I, I need to grit the keys. Keys, I think, are good. So right, one key, right, two key, three. Okay, now I got... I got three keys, I've got two, and then there's a fourth key. So apparently this first level should be easy, but we'll see. So I'm going to go through the lock. And it, and it disappears, and I've opened the door, and I've lost one key. Now go down. I have to go down. I have to waste a key. Now I'm going to collect another key, so I'm back up to two. And I've got two keys, uh, but there's two locks. How am I going to get through that? <laughs> this level's not easy. So how do you blow shit up? Uh, did I collect anything? That, or this is a bomb. I had got zero of them. How, how am I going to do? Okay, so let's just... Oh, I see. 
See, it was going to trick me. It was going to trick me to go up top. But my smart mind said, no, there's only two here. See, it's a, it's a puzzle. So I'm smart, and I go, one, two, buckle my shoe. So I was I smartened up, and then now I can get out. Look at that. You found an exit. Well done, TJ. Keys open locks. Uh, okay, so I did good. So now do I just press any key on the keyboard? Okay, uh, I need to write that code down. Uh, uh, zero, zero, two, forty-two. I wonder if these numbers are randomly generated or if it's the same for every single person's game. Okay, so I can see this game as a great puzzler for an airplane. You don't have to plug in headset because there's no sound. Uh, you can just play it on a little portable thing and have a fun time with 188 puzzles or whatever. Uh, okay, so here's a whole bunch of freaking locks. Uh, and there's dots. Are some of these... No, these, these are these bombs? Let's, call, let's touch one. I can't. It's a lock. Uh, so let's touch this thing to the... Uh, no, I didn't hit the right key. Okay, I did get it. Use cement to fill holes. Is this cement? Okay, I'm collecting cement. <laughs> okay, so now it's going to... It wants to... I got to go through two no matter what to fill the holes. So on this one, I, I could go either direction, right? So fill the hole. I, I lost... Who <laughs> thought I would be filling holes today? I didn't think I'd be filling holes. I'm not sweating yet. <laughs> you sweat for filling a lot of holes. Cement and post holes. Other holes we won't talk about. Okay, so so now, I mean, I have to go through this one. Now, my logical thing is I've got five left. I need to count. I've got no more. I've got five cement. So there's one, two, three, four... One, two, three. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, there's... Uh, how do you blow shit up? I don't have any fucking bo bombs. How would I swear on a game like this? It's not even... I mean, there's one hole, two hole, three hole, four hole. Oh, no, there's only three going up this way. Okay, I I, 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 I had to look. It was... So, one, two, uh, one, two, three. So, I don't have to collect this. So, there's two. And then there's the exit. Okay. See, I got nervous, but I didn't need to because I made it. Look at that. Okay, see, this is fun. I like it. I'm sure it's going to get more complicated. Uh, so let's... Um, there's no point system on this. It's just a level thing. Oh, there's color now. We're no longer Amish black and white. Uh, zero, zero, uh, three, three, nine. Uh, okay, I wrote down the number. Uh, okay. Uh, there's lots of little son of a bees weasels. They're magenta ones. Uh, what was it? I could kill the magenta ones. So let's go at least collect the key. We know I need the key. There's one lock, but I need do. Okay, so I need to collect dollars to pay off these son of a bees weasels. And there's a lot of dollars up here. It's luring me. There's eight dollars there and three here. If I open the lock. I'm going to only get one, two, three levels in, and I'm not going to get further. So I need to pay this butt weasel off. Uh, well, how do you do that? <laughs> uh, I, I, uh, do I blow him up with a space bar? Oh, shit. Uh, I, I, I need a dollar to pay him off. Uh, oh, I could go this direction. I got it. Okay, so I'm going to go open the door, and I'm going to collect the money. Now, instead of wasting $4 or $2, I'm going to go only waste $1 and go up and collect all these monies. Now I've got uh, $10 left. I want to go through the least amount I can. So one, two, three, four. I can collect that. So now I've got $7 left. One, two, three, four, five, six. What did I do wrong? There's only seven dollars. Uh, there's no bomb I can blow up. What bump weasel? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I'm not gonna get to the exit. You son of a bitch! <laughs> See how tricky it is? You're probably saying, "Teach." Okay, now I need to go back. So what was it? Return key. Uh, once. No, R once, and then any key. Uh, oh, do I need to type in the number? Zero zero three three nine. Zero zero three three nine. Okay, I'm back there. So what did I do wrong? I I know I have to get the key. 
uh, if I open this lock, last time I, uh, no, I, uh, did I go up there? I collected all the money. Uh, so I open the lock, collect one dollar, bribe this son of a bee's weasels, go down. Am I doing the same thing as I did last time? Okay, so no matter, I've got ten. Now, there's, and that's going to make eleven, but see, if I pay this schmug off, there's two. Oh, no, no, no. I see what I got to do. You go this way. You only pay him, him, and him. You collect another dollar. I've got eight. I'm still not going to do it, is it? Two. Oh, you son of a bitch! <laughs> what did I do wrong now? I, I must have paid off. I could have swore I was on the right track. I think I will play this one more time, but I think I've given you the the essence that this game is going to be fun. No freaking sound, but yet it's so intricately awesome. Okay, R, return. Uh, z what the hell was the number? 00339. 00339. Okay, I have to collect the key. Do or do I? <laughs> yeah, I... I mean, yeah, you, you got it because you got to get a dollar. So open the door. Okay. Now, last time I went up, I uh, you have to collect the dollar. <laughs> I mean, you collect the money uh, over here. But if I go three here, one, two, three, I get that dollar. If I go back up, I'm going to have to spend it to get that money. You bastard. <laughs> Uh, no matter how you eat this, I've got three. Let me try something. I don't know if this will work. One, two, three. One, two, three. You collect the extra doll. You've got one left. You have to then go up and pay off the piper to collect other. I don't think I'm, <laughs> I think I'm doing the same thing as before. You've got, yeah, it's, I'm on the same eight, but did I? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, I'm at the same freaking... <laughs> this game is rigged. It's rigged for smart people. Oh, I see what I did wrong before. You don't need to collect. See, it's... I, I'm smart. One, two, three, four. I did it. See, it's it's tricking you. It's tricking you to think you have to get them all, but you don't always have to catch every fish in the pond to have a good day. Look at that. Uh, I did good. I'm up to level four. So let me... Uh, what happened? Uh, oh, yeah, I'm, I'm writing down the code for later because I'm not going to keep playing this. I don't want to show you guys all the tricks, but... What a fun game. Bomb break... Oh, there's bombs! Well, let's play a little bit longer. I want to collect... So... Uh, oh, okay, so you touch the bomb and it auto-blows. Ooh. <laughs> Auto-blow. Okay, uh, so now... Uh, what the hell's that thing? <laughs> it's red. Okay, so um, I'm going to blow shit up. Uh, I've got $12. I don't know what you use the dollars for. There's a key. So I got to... Um, I want the key. Uh, does it cost each time you touch a bomb? Let's touch this one. And it blew that up. Okay. Um, oh, God. <laughs> Do I need this thing? I must need that thing. <laughs> oh, I don't want to blow up the exit. Son of a bee's weasels. Uh, is that going to blow up my exit if I touch it? Oh, let's get the key. I've got the key. Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, I know. You pay these son of a bitches off. One, two. Oh, the bomb's still here. <laughs> I need that to blow up. Do I need to touch that? I'm afraid to touch that bomb down there. It's going to bl blow the goose up. So I, I want to blow that up. And then walk around. Don't blow these up. Collect. Oh, no, that's a transporter. Uh, apparently, I can't touch the transporter. And if I touch that, you blew up dynamite. 
Oh, that's dynamite! Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, we're gonna end there. I don't want to show you how to get through this one because I don't know yet, but what a fun game. Let's make this a Sinclair Society Facebook group game of the week. If you're not in that group, join it. It's on Facebook. It's my group. Let's call this a wrap. Thanks for watching. Bye.